ladies and gentlemen, good evening. Uh, first of all, I would like to welcome all of you for our official opening day tonight. And I'll explain to you who we are and how the way we work. So, our international Coptic organization, we are registered, so if I go to the stage, I'd like to be here with all of you. So, our international Coptic Union, uh, we are registered in the United Nations and also we represent 27 countries around the world. Tonight I will explain to you two boards, our Australian branch board and our international of our organization board. So, our Australian branch board for International Coptic Union Organization, uh, Dr. Medhat Gerges, and General Secretary, Mr. Henny Gai. And we have two coordinators. We have New South Wales co coordinator, Mr. Ashraf Ibrahim. Would you want to stand up, please? So everyone knows you. <laughs> and we have our in uh, South Australia coordinator, Mr. Mike Gawain, you want to stand up for it? <laughs> Sorry, because I, I know all of you know Dr. Benhat and uh, Mr. Henny, so that's why I don't want to ask you to stand up, because we, the, we have actually, it's our honor to be, to have also in our organization. Um, we have the youth coordinator in all Australia, Mr. Peter Abraham <laughs> and the spokesman, which is me, Dr. Rock. <laughs> so this is our board. We have activities for the last six months. I would like to play now our some of our activities for the last six months. Okay. This one, we joined the Christian Democratic Party uh, for um, the Syrian and the Iraq Church. Remarkable place. And Mr. John Drake, he represented, and Mr. Fred Knight. And this some photos of our event there. We support. And that's one of our needs. We support all the Christians around the world Egyptian, Syrian, Iraq. This the Australian Heritage Day. It's um, being organized by ACNA. And uh, Mr. John Brady will mention this in his speech, I think. Um, it was a beautiful day. Really beautiful day. What, what we, that's one of our aim. We open our hand and our arm for everyone to work together to achieve one thing. For all the Christians, that's one thing. And the second thing, we are here in Australia, we are part of this society, we are part of this country, so we need to join and work together as a teamwork for better for Australia. Yeah, our international board, we have uh, Dr. Kamala Sorry, Mr. Kemal Abdelmour, he's uh, our chairman, uh, he's a living historian. We have in France, uh, Mrs. Austria. Austria, sorry, Austria. Uh, we have uh, uh, Ramsey, we have uh, Dr. Nagwewe from America, uh, our one as well in, in Egypt. Uh, so, if you go to everything here, I'm trying like hard to find some written in English. So this one, uh, this event happened in Egypt last month on the 15th of November. We have a really large one, and you can see the one represented from Alaska. One represented from Alaska. Uh, we talk about the Muslim Brotherhood because we try to force the government, especially here or here, as a terrorist group. So, uh, our international group, they have already 
very good meeting with uh, your parliament on the 15th of December, and they will mention everything there. Um, we represent and we support the Egyptian uh, economy and tourists and our election president, Mr. Afadah Sisi. Uh, the part of our tonight There is one surprise. Uh, our some of our leaders in 27 countries they they. Uh